Hello Twin Flames and welcome to this Heart Merge Power Cleanse. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. So what we're going to do in this message today is we're going to connect you and your twin together. Now I have done a Heart Merge very similar to this in the playlist you can check out but this is going to be something powerful today in this moment. So during this Power Cleanse you're going to be connected with your twin in a way the same way this person is connecting with the universe in the picture here. So you can choose how you want to sit to do this cleanse. Now a power cleanse is more powerful than a meditation. So obviously meditation is powerful, but it's a lot different. You're going to feel tingles throughout your body. You're going to feel alive. You're going to feel electric. You're going to feel strong. Whereas meditation is more relaxing. So this is a bit different than meditation. A power cleanse is more about being present in the here and now in a very powerful way. So you're going to feel all kinds of sensations. After the power cleanse, you may feel a bit dizzy or woozy. So it's always good to take a moment to bring your energy back and reconnect with the physical self. You know, because when we meditate or when we connect with the other realms or we connect on the 5D, sometimes it can be a bit disorientating coming back from that energy into a physical self, into the physical body. So really going to find your focus in this moment. So to do this power cleanse, this is going to be a heart merge. So you're going to feel the love and the power between you and you're going to feel your heart merging with their heart. You're also going to feel your third eye opening up to their third eye. So you're going to feel, you may feel heat around the third eye, the head, the forehead. You may feel heat around the heart chakra, but you could get heat or tingles or feelings anywhere in the body. And if you experience this after, don't worry, breathe through it and know that whatever you're going through, it's cleansing you, connecting you and giving you power. So when you're doing this power cleanse, you may want to make sure that you're not going to be distracted. Certainly don't do this when you're driving around or when you're at work. Do it when you have time for you. It's only going to take about 10 minutes. So find your place that feels sacred to you. You may want to go in a room and shut the door and, you know, just have some time for you. You may want to do this out in nature. Maybe you've got a sacred place you go to at home or outdoors that helps you to feel at one with everything. But you're going to connect with your twin in a powerful way. So whenever we do a power cleanse, we can choose how we want to sit. You know, for this merge, you're going to visualize your twin in front of you, sitting across from you. So you may want to sit in the position that this person is in in this card, you know, the yoga position, sitting cross-legged. Maybe you want to sit on the floor or on a yoga mat or in the garden. Or you may want to sit on a chair with your feet into the ground. So, you know, you've got no socks or shoes on and your feet are completely grounded into the ground below you. And it's up to you. You know, I wouldn't recommend lying down unless you feel you can visualize better when you're lying down because you may go into a sleep state and it's more about being alert as you do this. So the best way to get the benefits from doing this is to either sit on a chair with your feet on the ground or in the lotus position, you know, where you're sitting in this kind of position with your legs crossed on the ground. But no matter what, you're going to put your hands facing up. So in the picture there, she's got her hands facing down. You're going to sit with your hands resting on your lap above facing up. OK, so your palms are facing towards the, the, the air facing up. So that way you're going to be attracting. So when you've got your palms facing up, you are attracting energy in. You're also going to close your eyes so you can visualize better. Now, if you struggle to visualize, perhaps get a picture of your twin and maybe put the picture in front of yourself the way I've put this picture in front of you here. And then you can connect with your twin in that way. You can look into their eyes or into their face when you're doing this cleanse. But the most important thing is that you have time without distractions. That means your phone isn't going to go off or so that you can really connect with this energy today. So we're going to start off by breathing to bring us into the now. So when we breathe, we breathe in through the nose and we exhale through the mouth. So we breathe in together and we exhale together. Remember, feet on the floor, 
palms facing up, maybe closing your eyes. Let's breathe in together through the nose and release through the mouth. One more time, let's breathe in together through the nose and exhale through the mouth. So now your energy is clear and the angels are around you. So visualize yourself sitting where you are, completely calm and protected. You can feel the angels all around you, helping you to feel safe and at one with life and at one with your twin flame and the journey you are on. In this moment, you know that you are protected and there's nothing to fear. You may feel the energy being cleansed around you, the angels around you uplifting you, helping you to feel loved. You may be smiling right now as you feel this power enriching your vibration, uplifting your life, giving you power in your veins. You feel strong right now and you're ready to emit that strength and power through your heart space and your third eye to your twin. So visualize your twin sitting across from you. Start off by thinking about their energy and their presence and their light. You may even see their aura shining bright or you may feel them sitting across from you. Maybe you have a vision of them, you can see them clearly or you just know they're there. But right now you're calling your twin in to receive this power. And I feel your twin is walking up to you and sitting across from you, open to receive. Smiling at you, eager for the healing power and presence that they feel when they are next to you. They are eager to receive these light codes and this DNA activation. They are eager to receive the love and the light that you're preparing to send to them. So as you sit across from them and connect with them and feel them, Archangel Michael is now surrounding you in a bubble of white light. And that bubble of white light is protecting you and keeping you safe. It's surrounding you both in this bubble so nothing can penetrate it. Nothing can penetrate it but pure love. And going beyond the white light is a big layer of blue light. That's the layer of protection Archangel Michael is putting around you to shield you within this cocoon to make you feel safe. So in this moment right now, you and your twin are completely safe and surrounded by love and protection. So as you feel safe and you start to relax and breathe, breathing in through the nose and breathing out through the mouth, visualize a white light starting to emanate from your heart space. And that white light is beginning to grow and expand and get brighter. You may even feel it inside. You may see the white light has some pink hues in there. The pink is connected with the love and the romantic feelings and the unconditional love that you share. And that light may sparkle a little bit as it gets prepared to merge with your twin. So visualize now that light being sent from your heart space, your heart chakra opening like a beautiful flower, moving out of your heart space across the distance between you into their heart space and you may see their heart opening to receive this love and light and as he enters into their heart they feel warm and protected and safe and connected with you and all that is was and ever will be it's filling them up it's helping them to feel whole and protected and that light has power and as your person feels the warmth of this light, this beautiful light, pink light, bright and beautiful, they start to smile, to enjoy the feeling of you and the power of the connection. And as they feel that love, they start emanating the love back. 
So they also feel within them the love sparking in them and the light starting to radiate out of their heart and getting bigger and brighter and more loving and more powerful as they open up their heart to send the light back to your heart. So you may now visualize or see or feel their light from their heart coming over to you. And boom, you feel it in your heart. It feels warm and lovely and beautiful. And you feel it expanding all around you, filling you up and helping you to feel strong and safe and protected and filled with the power of unconditional love. And as you move into your head, you may see your third eye resting, starting to flicker and open with a glimmer of hope. And you may see purple light starting to form at your forehead and that light is getting bigger and brighter a beautiful purple hue that's starting to shimmer with rainbow light so you may see purple light you may see rainbow light you may see a mixture of the two and that light is getting bigger and brighter and you may feel your third eye beginning to open as you are ready to expand your vision and focus on love. And as your third eye begins to open, you feel your twin's third eye starting to flicker and open too. And you know they are ready to receive the light you wish to send to them. You feel the light expanding and you feel your third eye opening. And your third eye now is fully open and sending out that light. So you feel the light going from your third eye over the distance into their third eye. You are one in this moment and you may even feel your physical eyes fluttering or shaking around. You may feel your vision disorientated between you and them. You may feel things happening behind your eyelids right now, especially if your eyes are closed. You are safe. What's happening is your third eye is merging with their third eye to open you up more and more to the psychic link between you. So right now their third eye is open and accepting your light, accepting your power, your clear awareness, your psychic sense, it's your truth. And that's going into their third eye and it's hitting them, boom, and it feels strong. And it's creating downloads within them, tears, maybe even tears are running right now. You may feel your eyes watering, things are happening. You may feel light flickering behind your eyes as they take in your truth and the light of this journey and the power of it. And their third eye begins to open and they send that light back to you. You can feel that light coming back into your third eye and it feels strong and powerful. You feel ready, you know you are completely connected through telepathy, through the psychic link and the bond of the heart. You may even feel you putting your hands up now and feeling their hands merging with you. You may feel you are one, connected, protected, supported, with all the light of heaven surrounding you in a bubble and a cocoon of love. And as you feel this connection, you know you can tell them anything, you know you can ask them anything, and you know you feel the love. So feel this love. We're going to do some deep breaths, and I want you to connect with what you feel. What is your twin saying to you in this moment? What are you feeling? What words are flowing into your mind? Let's take in 10 deep breaths in and out and receive the messages, or send them a message from your higher self. Breathe in and breathe out. We're going to continue to do this together at your own pace, receiving the information. Breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in that love, releasing out that fear, feeling connected with everything. Breathing in, breathing out.
Allow your physical self to feel and experience any sensations, anything that's physically been shown to you, any flickering, any energy, any heaviness. It's all been lifted away. And the angels are cleansing you right now, allowing you to feel at one with everything and at peace with your twin. Now, when you're ready, you're going to go back into both of your bodies. So you're going to continue to carry this love around with you today. You're going to continue to feel the presence of your twin with you today. But you're going back within yourself. Right now, you're merging into each other. So look at your twin and say, it's safe for us to go around our day. It's safe for us to be apart yet together. It's safe for us to love. And as you say these words, you can feel the angels cleansing you and releasing any fear and any struggle around being separate, around being apart, around any delays, because you understand and know that you are one. And any time that you need to feel this love, you can connect with your twin in this powerful way. So you look at your twin and smile and you feel your third eye cleansed. You feel the power of the eye getting back to how it is. So it can still see, but it's calming down. And the heart chakra is releasing any fear to feel at one. And you are one. So you close your eyes and breathe in and feel at peace. Breathe in and breathe out. And when you're ready, open your eyes. Wow. Okay, my eyes are watering and running during that, I felt flickering going on and lots of energy and pressure around the third eye and the heart. So you may find that you feel disorientated a little bit right now. You may find you get a headache coming on. It's because of the power of the love. So right now you are connected with your twin and this connection will continue. And obviously you are always connected, but you're going to feel right now heightened senses. As you go around your day today, you may receive visions, signs. Some of you may even receive communication in a physical way because you've merged in this way. And that's bringing in power and bringing in light. So let me know in the comment section your experiences of this heart merge. And if anything happens today that blows your mind or even over the next day or so, make sure you come back and tell me in the comments how it's been for you. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.